Hi there. Now for this question, we're given that a curve has equation y equals f of x. And it is given that f dash x or f prime x equals 1 divided by the root of x plus 6 plus 6 divided by x squared. And that f of 3 equals 1. And we've got to find f of x for 5 marks. So if you'd like to have a go at this, haven't done so already, just give you a moment to pause the video. When you come back, I'll show you what the answer is. And if you then want to uh, look at my working, I'll take you through that. OK, welcome back if you had a go. Now, the answer to this is that f of x equals 2 times x plus 6 to the power half minus 6 over x minus 3. So if you didn't get that and want to see how it's done, I'll just take you through the answer. Now, if we're to get f of x, we need to integrate what we're given. f dash x, remember, is the equivalent of differentiating f of x with respect to x. So I'll just copy this down, first of all, that we've got 1 divided by the root of x plus 6, then plus 6 over x squared. So to get f of x then, we'll put therefore f of x is going to equal the integral of what we see here. So I need to rewrite this. This is 1 over x plus 6 to the power half. I bring that up to the top and it becomes x plus 6 to the power minus a half. And for this term here, this is 6 times 1 over x squared. 1 over x squared is x to the minus 2. So you end up with plus 6x to the power minus 2. I've got two terms here, so don't forget to put some brackets around this, OK? And then we integrate that all with respect to x. So when it comes on to this first term, you should be familiar with this type of integral, but just as a recap, if you've got anything of the form ax plus b to the power n, and you're integrating with respect to x, then the answer is ax plus b to the power n plus 1, all divided by a multiplied by m plus 1. And then you've got your constant of integration. So for this one, the a is the 1 here, OK? So ax, that would be 1x there. And n is the power minus a half. So what we're going to get then is x plus 6. Add 1 to the power, that becomes the power half. And we divide by a, well a as I say is 1, so I'm not going to write that in, and divide by n plus 1, so we're dividing by a half. And when it comes to integrating plus 6x to the minus 2, we add 1 to the power, so that's 6x to the power minus 1, and we divide by the new power, minus 1. And then we mustn't forget the constant of integration, plus c. So tidying this up, if we times top and bottom of our fraction here by 2, we're going to end up with 2 multiplied by x plus 6 to the power half. Or you could think of this as 1 divided by a half, which is 2. Okay. For this term here, 6 divided by minus 1 is minus 6. And then you've got x to the power minus 1, which is 1 over x. So 6 times 1 over x is just going to give you 6 over x. And then we've got plus c. Now we need to work out what the constant c is. And this is when we're given this information. We can use this to work out what the constant c is. So we'll just say that since okay, f of 3 equals 1. In other words, when x is 3, we know we get 1. So from here, it would follow that if we were to substitute 3 into here, we've got 3 plus 6, which is 9. 9 to the power of half, or the square root of 9, is 3. So you've got to get 2 times 3, which is 6. Okay, So we've got 6 for that first term. For this one, when we substitute 3 in, minus 6 divided by 3, which is minus 2. And then you've got plus c. And so this is f of 3, and it should equal 1. 
So what we've got now is 6 take away 2 is 4. 4 plus c equals 1. If we take away 4 from both sides, we get c equals 1 minus 4. So c equals minus 3. Okay, so therefore c equals minus 3. And all we need to do now is substitute the value of c back into this equation here. Let's just say we call it 1. Sub c equals minus 3 into 1. And what do we have? Well, we therefore end up with f of x equaling 2 times x plus 6 to the power half. Or you could write that as the 2 times the square root of x plus 6. Up to you minus 6 over x, and then plus c, c being adding minus 3, just gives us minus 3. And there you go.